Hey there, welcome back to Clip Studio Paint Quick Tips. My name's Scott Drummond. I'm a comic artist and illustrator. Today, we're gonna to learn how to set yourself up for success when creating flat colors for your comics. But hey, this is Quick Tips, so let's not waste any more time and jump right into it. Clip Studio Paint has a ton of great tools for coloring your comics, but with so many options, there's a lot of room to make things harder for yourself along the way. Luckily, there are a few changes you can make to the tools in Clip Studio Paint to get your flat colors ready for rendering. But first, let's look at why we want flats to begin with. These flats look great from far away, but once you get up close, you'll notice that the colors blend into each other. This makes it impossible to get a crisp selection of the whole character and basically makes these flats useless. On the other hand, these flats are nice and crisp, allowing me to select all the parts of the character quickly so I can do my rendering. In order to set your flats up like this, you need to make sure to disable anti-aliasing in your tools. If you use the G-Pen to flat, make sure to turn off anti-aliasing in the Tool Properties window for both the pen and the fill tool. If you want to use the Lasso tool first and then fill, make sure anti-aliasing is set to none. My favorite is the Lasso Fill tool, which combines the lasso and fill tools. Again, make sure anti-aliasing is set to none here. As you can see, I like to work big to small with my flats, so I can start with the big shapes and then use the auto select tool to help me work in the details as I go. And there we go, clean and professional flats that will get you set up for success in coloring. In our next video, we're gonna go over some tips for using these flats, as well as some blending modes so you can get some great colors for your comics. So make sure to subscribe so you can check out that and more great Clip Studio Paint quick tips. Thanks so much for watching. Now get out there and make some great comics.